this is just a quick video. I'm gonna just give you a tour of the facilities in Edward Street. Uh, so if we wanna come with you. It's obviously coronavirus at the moment, so we have to wear masks. Um, but we can still show you around, show you the facilities. We'll get into as many rooms as we can and I'll show you what's possible. So you can usually go in through the revolving door, but there's a one-way system at the moment. You use your student card to just scan in, you can get through doors with it. So this area is sometimes used for exhibition spaces. They also sometimes exhibit work upstairs. There's a big open space where you can yeah, exhibit your work. So let's just put this. So most moving image and photography students uh, use uh, stick around in the basement most of the time. It's got all the facilities that you need. It's got a computer suite just over here. It's got a dark room down there. And it's got uh, some moving image studios and it's got a screening room, like a cinema room, where you can like look at your work as if it was actually being shown. Um, yeah, let's go down and see what it is. Actually, first I'll show you some uh, photography studios, the upstairs photography studios, because uh, they have more lights, more equipment in there if you wanted to take some really nice photographs. We've I'm going to see if this the girl in this room will see if she wants to talk to us quickly. Hi, yeah, it's just me. Uh, how's it going? Yeah, it's alright. How are you? Yeah, good. I was just uh, quickly going to show show off the, the facilities. We've got some we've got some nice lights and that, like. To be fair, you have set this up fantastically, I've got to say. So yeah, it's looking really nice in here. Uh, it's got a little light and everything. It's got really good tripods. Things like that. Well, thank you for that, Nazir. Um, yeah, so there's another studio just there as well, which has uh, lights that hang from the ceiling. We can't use that one at the moment. It's got a lot of really good stuff. These are the jarring and yellow stairs. They're really nice. Sends you down into the basement. So yeah, just up these stairs, there's another exhibition space that we're not allowed to access at the moment. how you want to lay out your photographs if you take a photograph. You can like use these magnets on the wall to like place out how you want them to look just in just to practice for exhibiting and things like that. It's really useful. Often when the uni's more in full swing there'll be people down here testing out how they want their photos to look. This is the moving image studio room. So um, we'll go. We'll have a tour. We'll have an interview with the guy who, who helps you out with that. He's a he's a great guy. Top quality. This is the computer suite. Uh, it's just it's full of quite high powered Apple computers, and they really efficient if you want to use any of the any of the Adobe suite they're all kitted out 
Okay, so this is the moving image studio. It's a useful place to come and make films and stuff like that. It's like another studio, a bit like the photography studios upstairs, but with access to things like, like easier access to things like um, projectors, like 16mm or 8mm projectors, and you can come and like digitally transfer those over in here. There's a good room to do that in. Um, it's got it's got the same sort of backdrops and things. Your classic, your classic backdrop. That's <laughs> broken. <laughs> um, I'll fix that in a second. Um, yeah, we've got this room. It's one of my favourite rooms. This is the uh, this is like a place where you can test out installation work. And they've got they've got tons of monitors and tons of speakers and things like that. So you can you can like test out how you want your installation to look. You can test out with different kinds of monitors. Here, someone's someone's clearly using these these guys to uh, to make something. Just curious to see what they're making. You know, I'm sure they'll. Hello. Okay. Uh, yeah. So here's a, here's a bunch of the monitors that you can use here. It's got different sizes, different kinds of monitors. There's black and white ones. They have, they they're all old school ones, so they've got like uh, different controls on them and things. All of them are different. It's fun to come and experiment with what you can use. A bunch of speakers here. These are the kind of like this is a pretty mad camera. Pretty crazy stuff. Matt. Uh, yeah, uh, Matt, the guy who is the moving image tech, we will interview him later and he'll talk about some of the equipment that you can hire out from here. Next I'll take you to a room that we... Oh. <laughs> Next I'll take you to a room that we um, often have lectures in. This is the screening room. It works similarly to a cinema. So the, often the lecturer sits where you're sitting now and um, explains to you what's going on. We all sit here, we learn from them. And there's like, they show us films on the, on the screen here. And um, yeah, it's really, it's really useful. It's, it's often helpful to um, to view your work as if it's actually in a cinema setting. So yeah, that's really good. High quality projectors, often as well. Sometimes, sometimes they actually um, hire out films. Like we watched Castle, pre the wall film that you can only really hire because it involves hanging a light from the ceiling that is then the shadow of it is here and they hired that out and they got the equipment and they set it up for us and then project it like proper actual copies 16 millimeter copies it's pretty nice and everyone comes in watches it it's a good time Quite a novelty having your lectures in a uh, cinema as well. We'll come through here back into the computer suite and I'll show you some of the facilities that we have to go around. <laughs> I'll show you some of the editing facilities. So in here, often they have like a, a tech lecture, so they teach you some things about the Adobe Suite, like Audition sometimes if you want to work with sound, and like obviously Premiere Pro or Photoshop, Lightroom, all of, all of, the, all of the software, you can just ask the technicians and they'll help you out. Often a tech workshop involves people sitting here and learning on the computers, and then there's a screen just behind you, which, um, which they demonstrate on 
Oh, this is the print bureau. So if you want to print something on high quality paper or anything like that, um, they've got all the equipment that you need. It's really good printers over there. <laughs> They're not in at the moment, so we can't ask them any questions. These are some edit suites, just what these two. And I'll go in here, I'll see if the people in here will let us have a quick chat with them. Hey, how's it going? Hello. Hey, you mind if we uh, film yeah. something we do, yeah. please? Wow, that looks pretty cool, man. Thanks. It's nicely shot. Um, yeah, so this is just like one of the edit suites. F super fast computers that can handle Adobe software quickly. And uh, it's got specially painted walls, funnily enough. Apparently these walls are like the perfect grey um, <laughs> to edit with. I don't, I don't really understand how. How do you guys find it in here? Yeah, it's great. Love yeah. these new computers. Yeah. Banging. Yeah. yeah. Well, I'll see you guys in a minute, I suppose. Okay. All right. All right Bye. Thank you. Bye. This brings this us for editing actual, uh, actual film. <laughs> we, don't, we don't have the right card. Yeah, okay. Yeah, the techs aren't in right now as well because they're on lunch, so uh, we can't show you this one, <laughs> unfortunately. But in there they have um, in there they have an editing suite with a screen, so you can edit. You can edit. <laughs> it's all falling apart, mate. <laughs> um, so you can edit like um, eight millimeter footage really easily, quickly. Nice place to work as well. These little booths are quite nice. Sometimes have one-on-ones with your lectures here. It's nice. Here you go, someone's doing work in this one. That's ideal. This is our saviour, Matt. Oh, hi. Hey, Jamie. Hey, you good? Yeah, kids, you? Yeah, kids, yeah. Oh, he's just making a quick tour of the... Oh, yeah. ...the mm -hmm. stuff. Um, yeah. Yeah, we're just showing all the, all the different facilities and equipment mm -hmm. and things like that. Mm -hmm. uh, Right. This this guy this guy knows everything <laughs> everything you need to know. I do know everything by everything. That's he's, so, he's, so he's true. A proper genius yes, when it comes to genius, yeah. any questions that you have about equipment or anything. <clears throat> this this man, lifesaver. Proper so nice guy as well. Is there anything you need to know about like the course or <laughs> the kit or does this look stylish? Yeah, yeah, I'd love it if we could <laughs> we could have a little tour of the kit room. Yeah, do you want to do that? Do you want to do that? No, no, let's do it. Oh, thank you. <coughs> yeah, sorry, this is quite impromptu. <laughs> so what, we just decided to do it one yeah, shot, yeah. as if it's a real tour. So. It is. It is. Yeah. Uh, <coughs> All right, well, thanks, Matt. Right. Um, Kick me. Um, what do you want to know? So this is this is where we keep uh, a lot of our equipment. Um, We've got everything from 16 millimeter Bolex cameras right through to like four, 6K production cameras. And we try and keep a nice different range of stock. So some students like to work on like really old Hi8 or kind of video. Some people like to make really clean kind of looking work. So uh, we've got a mix of everything for lots of different types of work here. Yeah, totally. And you guys you guys are always here to help, right, with like yeah. installations mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. like if someone's confused about how to use a project a like projector. Yeah. yeah. You got you got all the know how. All the yeah, skills. yeah. So we like run workshops uh, for everybody and we help out with shows and make an individual piece of work. Um, so yeah we're just here to, to realise the creative dream that is yeah, moving exactly, in Exactly, exactly. Yeah, Anything is possible, that's Anything. the key. It's a key thing to remember. Um, yeah, well, thanks, Matt. All right, no worries. I'm going to run into the dark room now and see what's yeah, going yeah, on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, see right. you later. Cheers, right, Cheers. He, honestly, one of the nicest guys. The only guy who like, really knows how to help you out in all situations. And Jess, Matt and Jess, the two moving image techs. And if you're on photography, to be fair, there's, there's also really good text as well. One of them's called Mark. He's the guy who really knows his stuff. 
I don't think I'm going to be let into this room. Let's give it a go, eh? Look at that. Okay. So this is the dark room facility. It's got everything you're going to need. It's, so this is like the... It's kind of the water, right? This is where you're going to be like developing your films and things like that, like loading it up into these and processing it so it, so you, you can then enlarge them. It's got things like a brush Pretty fancy looking drying cabinets to be fair. High end. Drying mats. Oh, I know that girl. So you want to uh, check out the enlarging, the enlarging spaces. This, so this is the like proper dark room. You probably won't be able to see me much. Um, also, you don't really have to wear goggles. So yeah, I, I'm assuming that you can't see me at all because that we're in the dark room. But um, maybe here we can check out the enlarging booth. One of these. Does it pick it up? Mm. Yeah, so here you got an enlarger. It's a pretty good one. Goes up and down, things like that, you know. And it's actually a, it's a private booth, so if you want to enlarge, you can you can close the curtains and have your own little space to enlarge with. Um, there's lots of different booths, quite a few of them. And we can go through here if you want into the uh, into this, the dark room processing room where you can do all this kind of stuff. So here's your like real dark room. Oh, sorry, <laughs> we're just filming a quick tour. <laughs> so like, yeah, you've got more enlargers here. And uh, water bath and things, everything you need. Can you, can you see it? Yeah. <laughs> So these are all 35 mm enlargers, most of them. And uh, yeah, the equipment that you're going to need. Thank you. <laughs> this is to dry your prints, so it's good. Everything. Hopefully this video helped out a bit and gave you an idea of what you can do here. Um, yeah, usually there's more people kicking about and doing their work, but uh, yeah, there's not that many people here today. Um, so yeah, come check it out for yourself.